Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I'm going to film the week of May 13th to May 19th. Um, so this is a rewind plan with me. I'm going to be show, be using this Little Miss Papery um, Thanksgiving kit. I believe I got this from uh, Black Friday. So you have this little freebie. You have the glitter headers, you have your eight full boxes, icons, have boxes, quarter boxes, labels, uh, sorry, headers, habit trackers, and here you have another round of quarter of quarter boxes, sorry, half boxes, date covers, checklists, work labels, and you have your washi and your deco. So that's what we're working with today. Um, I also have this washi from Simply Gilded. I am not sure which one I'm going to use. So I have two Simply Gilded washi, which are these ones. So this is a pink polka dot with uh, silver foil bows. This is from the Carousel um, full bo uh, sub box. And I might actually use this once more with love uh, washi from the pre-sale. Let me zoom, zoom you in a little bit. So this is the washi. I might actually use this one. I think the collection is called Happily Ever After. And I'm also going to be using these headers, clear foil headers, washi tape or sticky tape from Rose Collar Days. Um, with all of that I will be using a bunch of icons from my stash. So there are different shops, um, Once More With Love, Coffee, The Coffee Monsters Co, My Little Puffy, um, Create With Pen, Planet Beautiful and a few foiled icons. So let's get into it. So we are going to start with the full boxes. Um, I usually put the quote full box on the corner and if there's no quote full box I tend to choose something a little bit more um, that goes with the team. So I did white out the lines be below the, where the full box would go because then I can put the washi um, more accurately in place and don't have the line seen through the washi tape unless the washi tape is like really dark um, then I don't I don't use white out I'm sorry for the many times you're gonna see my planner moving around it's because um, I'm still working out the details on uh, placement of the in my desk so um, here I put down my usual habit trackers which I used to have it to track my no spend and I have to say I'm going I'm doing pretty well again I used white out to um, put down the full box the washi and I inverted the washi on this so I have the the pink going closer to where the pink tracker is and then I lay down the 10 millimeter uh, washi at the bottom so just as a recap this is a once more with love pre-sale washi it's called happily ever after I think it's um, to celebrate her upcom March's upcoming wedding and I use usually use 10 millimeters at all of my spreads be it simply gilded or any other washi and this one matched perfectly the colors of the, the kit and I do that at the second part of the week which is the weekend but I only go up to the first page of the weekend because on the other page if the kit does have wash a uh, bottom washi I tend to use that as decoration and to fill out space because I usually don't use a lot of that um, final page of the weekend 
where you have the to do and workout lists. So back to the first part of the week. Um, this is a rewind plan with me. Um, so here I'm putting a once more with love, no spend uh, munchkin. And now I'm going to do the full boxes. So I started with this scene kind of full boxes, which is the truck. So because it's a double box, so to speak, I'm measuring out whereabouts would be in the middle. And I use my quote box as a reference. So I put that one first. And then you're going to see me changing my mind a little bit. So I put the full boxes down and then I decided to put some headers um, on top. But then I realized that it would look weird. So I changed my mind. Um, one thing that I do every time is put the first full box of the week on the middle. Um, and that gives me an idea of what to do next um, for the following uh, days. So it, as I was mentioning, you can see that I did put all of the headers on top. Um, as, you know, top headers. And then I realized that that would look weird because I just... I have this thing that a full box cannot be on its own, if you know what I mean. It, it has to have something on top of it or below it to, I don't know, make make sure that I know that it's not, that it's just a full box. I, I don't know, it's weird. but um, So I realized when I put Tuesday down that I'm like, oh, this is going to look weird. So I changed the placement of the headers to up at every full box so you're gonna see me just taking out the other headers to align the headers with the full boxes that I'm gonna put down so I usually go middle top bottom middle top and then the weekend in the middle and um, but yeah um, this is a rewind plan with me because I wish I had the time to, you know, stay home and plan slowly and, you know, I wish I also had more things in my day. Like, I don't have kids, I have my pets and I don't have activities. So my days are pretty routine like I know what I'm gonna do every day I know what's gonna happen every day so in the in that sense I know it's gonna be boring if I do a beforehand plan with me instead of a rewind plan with me um, and whatever is not my routine is are the things that I want to be on my planner because they are the exciting things happening in my day um, so that's why I usually don't do, uh, you probably never see me doing a beforehand plan with me. It's always going to be a rewind plan with me. So here um, I was putting down my headers, uh, my date covers, and of course I did a mistake and had to pull, d pull up Thursday because I put it on top of Wednesday. Um, but yeah, this kit had two types of... Um, had this uh, date covers and they were the other one was a dark red and I just felt that it, it would be too dark so I decided to go with the the greenish one um, I put the headers on top of the box and I really enjoyed how it looks so here I am measuring <laughs> the weekend like what is gonna look better the full one or the denty one so I went with the denty one and I had the worst time trying to put this and making it look you know um, proper like not crooked <laughs> um, the next thing I usually do so these are my basics right so the next thing I do is put the covers or quarter boxes on top of the headers of this, these inserts. These inserts are from Jessenia Printables on Etsy and they are week on three pages if I'm not mistaken. Dated week, week on three pages. Um, so I cover that up because I have my own things that I like to track on those boxes and the, the headers she has are not fitted, suited for my needs. 
so like I said I do the full boxes I do the washi at the end of the spread of the insert if the kit comes with washi um, if it doesn't come with washi I will use my own washi to cover that up and a lot of white out um, this kit came with some thin washi strips as you can see like lines I don't know if I bought the wrong size kit or whatever it was but it came with them and I really enjoyed and thought it was a really nice touch to the washi um, stickering so I think that that looked nice and it was a good way of using that strip of washi lined washi and again I cut down the, the leftover or the excess of a washi at the end and that's my base base done so then I work with what happened on that week I have a pad from GP studio that I used to mark what happened on my day and like I said I mark down things that are trivial and things that are outside my routine um, I really wish I could provide content for you know a lot of content but I don't have the time I have a very stressful job and um, poor time management I would say anyway I put down a little um, quarter box and a coffee monsters a the coffee monster co little coffee emoji to mark coffee Monday and I uh, had a and a work that came work box that came with the kit and I put down my hours because I have to, I'm a contractor and I have to lodge my hours um, and a little computer icon from bubblegum stickers um, her shops closed but I really like those um, icons and I put these two um, little circles to mark what I needed to finish that week it was an accomplished accomplishment to finish those two tasks at work and I marked that up on my planner because I felt accomplished another quarter box and then I'm putting down a little cooking um, character from the house of planets and marking down what I had for lunch because my lunch was delicious then my staple is uh, this icon foiled icon by Sharina J on Etsy and I'm marking down my Instagram post next I'm using the GP studio um, sticky note sticker and this was on a s advent calendar that they released and um, using it as a layering to put down that I need to water my plants and I'm using that cute icon from Moki Mochi Kichi I think it's the name of the shop um, and I'm using the permanent marker because the sticker GP sticker studio is requires um, the Sharpie permanent marker so another header and then the work label again the work box again and another um, little sticker to mark work and lodge my hours then my 10 millimeter washi that's when I put the today header because the red on the red would look very weird so that's why I did I've done that a quarter box uh, sorry a half box with a let's go shopping that came with the kit because that day I bought my foxy fix rings pocket rings and I'm gonna try that to take to work feel that I have a lot of sticky notes and not enough planner in my on my work <laughs> and that's a paper muse craft um, icon 
to mark that I needed to clean my litter trays for my cats and another header to mark down my happy mail for that day with a quarter box a quarter box is a really really tiny I love it I honestly absolutely love it and I also used um, uh, I got every knit a story happy mail that day uh, which was really nice so um, here I'm using the other um, yet another work box and here I'm gonna use a little computer from the kit because the colors I had for the other um, shop would not match with the kit it, it would clash with the, the colors of the kit so that's what I've done and more washi because why have washi if you're not going to use it so I'm trying to use all of the washi but that's going to be really really hard to use all of the washi um, this is from Tassel Planner I love her I love her shop and that's a reminder to pay my credit card then another header I never thought I would use so many headers at first I didn't use a lot of headers never liked headers a lot uh, another half box at the bottom because um, my husband was home and we actually g got to spend some time together that day after not seeing each other a lot um, he works not um, shift work so it's a little bit complicated a flag from the, the kit and another icon from the house of planner to mark my happy mail that day which was once more with love and all her beautiful goodies uh, had a, a to-do header this kit didn't come with a lot of headers which is kind of okay with me um, not sure a lot of people would appreciate it but I did because I don't use headers a lot and that was my checklist kind of way with those envelopes from the kit to mark that I had to consolidate and request shipping for all my US addresses I have two at the moment but I'm just gonna start using just the one uh, because I didn't like the service of the second one so I've done that and hopefully I'll have a haul up very soon probably next week with all of the goodies that are gonna arrive from the US um, here my camera cut I had a full card so I got uh, a work again with the other a work label with the other um, computer from the kit and I also that line um, I also used as the thin strip thin strip of washi that came with the kit to separate it then another quarter box with the house of planner icons and here a half box with a the emoji because it was so much stress that day at work and I was just done with it and I of course had a pizza for dinner that I've made myself with cauliflower base and it was absolutely yummy so up to Friday I put down the final work sticker thank god it was Friday I was really ready for the weekend and to be able to play with my stickers um, and it was a big coffee kind of day so I'm using that from uh, my little no mocky mocky god I cannot say that at all mochi kichi I think it's the name of the shop uh, the link will be down below um, another quarter box and a little pen to mark from GP Studio to mark down that it was VB Pens release. Um, they had this imperfect pack, pack release. They were clear, clearing out, and I wanted to. Um, I don't have a lot of VB pens, so I wanted to take the the deal. Um, that is from that characters and emotive from the Coffee Monster Scale to mark down poop duty for clean the litter tray for my cats another um, another 
had a, a glitter header and I had burgers for dinner that day, homemade burgers that the husband did and it was really, really yummy. Um, and then I just wanted to sleep because I was so tired and I went to bed like 9.30 in the night, <laughs> like an old lady, uh, but it was really good. And I got to sleep in on Saturday. Um, when I say sleep in, I wake up every day 5.30 in the morning. So I got to sleep until 8, I guess. That's when the cats woke me up. Um, so that was good. Um, so here I'm splitting up my day, my weekend, because I wanted to film and film this rewind plan with me um, and make sure that I had the whole day to do it. I'm not I mean, it took me like an hour and a half, but then you have to um, edit and do all that. So that's the strip of washi that came with the kit that I was talking about. And it's a half box, um, another quarter box, and this washi stack from Tickle Pink Planning. And that was to mark Simply Gilded washi release that I didn't have to wake up at 2 a.m. to to get it which was beautiful <laughs> and uh, a laundry um, laundry day sticker and then, then again by Sharina Jane to mark my Instagram posts um, I layered the laundry day with um, a washi strip that came with the kit so you see that there's an awkward space there I usually use what I call accents to fill out awkward spaces and they're usually foiled and that's from Arctic Paper Studio here in Australia. They make beautiful clear foil stickers. Um, I put up, sorry about the replacement of the camera, I put up a edit icon from Oscar and Lou to remind myself that I wanted to edit this video yesterday. I ended up um, editing it um, on the Saturday night. Another stack from Tickled Pink to mark the washi free sale from the Coffee Monkeys Co and a little vacuum icon from the Arctic Paper Studio to mark that I wanted to clean the house and an Audi from Coffee Monsters Co for groceries and all of the things happening on the weekend it's complicated um, a little camera from the the kit to mark that I wanted to do voiceover and here I wanted to put the, the washi but it would be washi on washi and I, I don't know if I like that but that's what I did so I put down more washi um, to mark down the end of my tasks and I put down my a little planner that came with the kit to mark down that I wanted to have some planning time I probably I'll probably be doing my pocket room setup um, on the side I just put a quote from a little heart from planner stickers Australia it's just smile that's my happy thought of the week um, and the deco from the kit goes on the corners of the boxes and next to the quarter boxes that I use on the other page so I was try, trying to get something that would fit and not look too big near the quarter boxes. I wanted to put the I wanted to put the little truck on one of them, but it was too big. So I decided to put the truck down at the bottom on my notes. Um, the notes I use to mark down my Instagram followers. And I usually use a quarter box or uh, I usually use a half box to mark um, mark it down on that space. Yeah, I'm using rose color days uh, this week this week um, foiled <laughs> sticker and I'm also using a planner stickers AU little things foiled sticker as well as sticker slot studio memories that's a custom so that was really nice that I could get one of those 
and also again rose color days on a happy nail so those are the things that i mark on those boxes little things this week happy nail and memories because i do a little bit of memory memory uh, planning on this these inserts um, that's my instagram followers have box like i said and then i just put down a washi strip from the kit i am not a fan of that it's it looks too cluttered but i, I might change that um what's happening next week is i'm renewing my contract at work which is a good thing i still have a job <laughs> and then just writing down what i what was the what were the highlights of the week my coffee monsters go pre-sale and simply gilded releases and vb pen and imperfect pack releases um, the little things are usually um, things that i have to do like P, uh, post office run or something like that if i have them happening that week happy mail is just a way of tracking of what i received that day because that will go onto my um onto my erin condren spreads and i like to remember what i've had that day um little things so things that i have to do a lot and that's it everyone, this is my spread for this week. The only other thing that I'm going to do is put a quality here and my memories here. So I hope you enjoyed this video, I hope you enjoyed this plan with me. Give a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you guys very shortly with another video, but this time on my Erin Condren. Bye!